Oh, of course. Let's go 25 miles an hour on a freeway on ramp. That makes sense. Uh, so, what's your guys' opinions on the whole loud pipe to save lives thing? I always thought it was bullshit. Like, your exhaust is behind you. People like the Civic right here is not fucking. They can't hear me. You know, they got to get around them. Otherwise, they're gonna hit you. Pull into your lane or just you know whatever. Uh, I always thought it was bullshit. Uh, you know, on my first bike, I didn't have exhaust for the longest time. Didn't really pay attention to things, you know, put an exhaust on. I rarely got hit on my little bike, or you know, almost hit, I should say, on my little uh, supermoto. It was just too loud, I suppose. Or I don't, I don't know, I just, I never almost got hit. It was just, a, it was a rare occurrence, you know. Once every couple months, maybe, I'd have somebody pull out in front of me, you know. And then I got a big old birthday here, big old v stramp. Uh, with the stock exhaust, it's, I mean, it's super nice, dude, it's quiet, but it was every single day I had somebody pulling out in front of me, switching lanes into me, you know, I had a little weak, weak horn at the time, and they didn't, you know, you lay on your horn, they just keep on coming, so I ended up getting a, a, a loud horn, you know, a car horn, so I mean, it helps a little bit when something comes to my lane, but then I got my exhaust on the bike, and I don't have anybody turning into me anymore. I don't know if it's like placebo effect or some mythical creature sitting on my back protecting me, but I really haven't, since I put my exhaust about a month ago or so, I haven't had anybody pull into me. It's, I don't know, it's crazy. I mean, my bike is not overly loud, but it does got some bark to it. I guess we'll see in the tunnel, because the tunnel's fun. What does Baker X there say? Uh, tunnel ropes. But, uh, yeah, I mean, have you guys had similar experiences with that? My brother rides, uh, first bike XT225, then a Virago 250, and now he's got a CB500X. Um, and his Virago was the only one he put aftermarket exhaust on, and that's the only bike where he really didn't have issues with people turning into him. It's on a big, tall, white CB500. Once again, it's like a daily occurrence. Let's Oh yeah! Wow! See, that person got out of my way. Heard me coming, I guess. Oh, I guess they saw me with my headlight. Oh, so the scariest fucking thing happened. I was coming through this tunnel the other direction, right? Just before I had my exhaust, thank God. And, uh, cutting in between cars like a madman trying to get home. And I'm doing like 105 miles an hour. And I, I'm i cutting through lanes, right? And then I cut through into the middle lane. There's a fucking cop sitting right in the middle of the lane. And I'm coming up to his ass fucking fast. Because it's like 55 through there. And uh, it's a delicate balance, you know? You can't just slam on your brakes because he's going to look and see your front nose dive. And he's going to know you're speeding. And you can't just speed up on his ass because then he's really going to look and know that you're speeding. So I'm like, oh shit, gotta slow down, but you can't slow down too fast. How's it going, buddy? That was a uh, close call.